this demonstration, we're going to look at configuring retention tags and retention policies. A retention tag defines managed content settings, and we've got retention policy tags, default policy tags, and personal tags. And what these do is they define what um, sort of mail that we actually want to retain. What we then do with those tags is we then apply policies. And what the policies do is they apply retention policies to mailboxes by using the exchange management shell. Or the exchange control panel so the purpose really is to manage email so managing inboxes sent items deleted items and so on so what we'll do here is we'll just create a new retention policy tag so we're at the mailbox server under organization what we have down here is we have a new retention policy tag wizard so we'll click on this and what we're going to do here is we're just going to create a new one and we're going to call this one deleted items removal So we'll have that in place and then what we'll do here is we'll just specify deleted items and then what we'll do here is we'll set this for 30 days and then in the case of the action to take what we'll do is we'll permanently delete the data. In the comments field all we put here is that deleted items are purged after 30 days. Now that we've done all that, we'll just click New. We'll then click Finish. Now what we'll do is we'll just create a new retention policy. So at this point, next thing to do, new retention policy. And on the new retention policy, what we're going to do is we're going to call this one Deleted Items. And we'll say Policy. And then what we'll do, we'll just click Add. And we'll add in, in the case of this, our Deleted Items removal and click OK and we'll select our next button and in the case of the select mailboxes we'll just click add and what we'll do here is we'll just add in let's go for Jane so we'll apply this to Jane select next select new now that could have been applied to a group or to an individual user we'll then click the finish button and what we've got is we've got this deleted item policy tag which is a retention policy tag and what we're seeing with this tag is to remove all of Jane's deleted items after 30 days from it actually entering into deleted items. We've then created a policy and that policy then applies that tag to Jane and I'll see in this demonstration thanks.